Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we're on the Great Carrier Reef because yesterday I went on the internet and I found this video posted by, yeah, him again. I know, I know, but in my defense, this time I did it first, okay? But anyway, um, basically watching that video, it gave me some ideas to try and experiment with this concept of using pulse miners to interact with dispensed projectiles like like these or these these or these and one of them was an orbital cannon which i will do at some point but today i want to see if i can make a minesweeper so yeah let's um let me quickly make like a test bed that we can drive all right and here we are we have a basic but i forgot that they changed these default controls all right now we have ourselves a basic boat that goes and speed So now what I want to do is arrange some sort of apparatus on the front that will allow me to push things out of the way, like mines and torpedoes. And so to begin with, I believe I want to try the small pass miners just because they fire faster. I don't know if that'll be good or not. And I also want to piston propel the projectile that the pulse miner launches because you can do that and it will go pretty fast that way. That's a lot more reliable. So now, let's grab a landmine. Not a landmine. A sea mine. And put it in the water. Let's go over here. Yoink. And now we turn around and fire our machine at it. All right. So being able to push the mine away is somewhat successful, but we are catching up to it. So I don't know. Yeah. So let's try a if it's if it's struggling this much with a C mine, then a torpedo coming in at full force is going to be even worse. So what I suggest we do instead is do this, which This is probably not even gonna like these timings. We're getting every last little bit of range. So now, let's try this on the sea mine and see if I can keep it away from the boat. Oh, okay. It exploded. So that's useful. So now let's uh, try it on a torpedo. See if it will uh, stay away. I don't know what the speed is on these, so I don't know if I'll be able to overtake it. I 
Okay, yeah, it's it's too fast. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hold on. What if I launch it at the spawn point? And then respawn. Is it still there? Yes! Now I need to see if I deflect it. <gasps> yes! Oh! It works! Oh my god, it works. It actually works. Yo, 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 yo. It works. Okay, so now I need a shield of these that just works in every single direction. See, now this is cool. Now off it goes. Now let's spawn in my boat with some torpedoes in it. But there it is. Okay, here we are. Now we're going to chase. We're going to chase with some torpedoes. See if any of them make it and destroy destroy this uh, thing. Let's turn off the waves. So nobody needs the waves. Alright, here we go. That's not the right... Yeah. I accidentally launched the regular torpedoes instead. Come here. Let's go this way. Okay, what's going on? Here? What the hell? Eh. Yo, yo, what on earth? Hello. What's going on here? That's backspace. What the hell? No. No, 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 no. What? What are we on right now? We've got to save. Thankfully, it's very slow, so it's easy to catch up. Alright, here we go. First, I'm going to test by putting some sea mines in front of it. I think it's this button. Yes, it is. Okay, right, let's see. Yes, it's pushing them away. Very good. Okay, they exploded, but did it damage? Let's see. A little bit, but if it exploded point blank, it would have been a lot worse. So I'd consider that a success. Let's continue. By launching some torpedoes at it. So that's this button. Yo. Okay, some of them exploded. 
at least one exploded. Is it okay? And... The same hull block seems to have taken another hit, and that's it. So I'd consider this... a successful... uh... thing. I don't know what to call it, but it is successful. Now, I wonder... Could I, instead of using pistons to propel these pulse miners, could I instead just piston glitch some more? Hmm. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Instead of all of this willy-nilly, let's just do this. See, that basically works the same. And I think it's better. Because we have a more impenetrable barrier. What I want to I want to see if I can make it slowly rotate as well. To provide even better coverage. Because the further out you get, you see that there's like slight blind spots. So I want to see... If I can fix that. So now, I want to make it look a bit prettier. Which might prove to be a bit strange to do. But I'll make it happen. Unfortunately, I have no way to test this in the field, because, uh, well, I can't be bothered to join a public server right now, and even if I did, they probably wouldn't be doing what I would like them to do. But that's okay, um, and as for my friends, well, my friends aren't online right now, so it's, it's, it's fine, it's fine. It is absolutely okay. It is absolutely a-okay. It works, and it's beautiful, and we spawn off of the boat. Fantastic. It's okay. We have the ability to push mines and torpedoes and depth charges out of the way to keep the boat safe. And that is all I wanted to achieve for today, which means this video was a great success. If you enjoyed, definitely leave a like and perhaps even consider subscribing. It's free. You can always change your mind later and it helps me out a ton with, once again, no extra cost to you. So if you subscribe, that would be very, very cool. But that's going to do it from me for today. My name is Edify and this has been the making of a Minesweeper that uses pulse miners to sweep the mines out of the way. I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.